All right, now a spring storm has brought snow, rain and also wind that has shut airports and has left thousands of people without power in the United States over the weekend. Now here's a look at what happened. What you see on your screen is what the United States woke up to on Sunday. A spring storm pushed in record snowfall, heavy winds, rain and hail, pounding the United States from the Gulf Coast to the Great Lakes. The worst of the snow was focused on the upper Great Lakes, with Green Bay, Wisconsin, seeing its second largest snowstorm ever. My truck stuck. It's not much, not much we can really do except for plow ourselves out. In Minnesota, the city of Duluth was hard hit, with snow falling throughout the day. In Michigan, over 300,000 homes and businesses were left without power. According to reports, a two-year-old girl was killed after a tree fell on a mobile home in Louisiana. While in Wisconsin, a woman was killed after she lost control of her vehicle and rammed into an SUV. The storms dumped snow and ice in Canada as well. Toronto witnessed some 200 traffic accidents over the weekend. More than 750 flights in and out of airports in Minnesota and Toronto were cancelled. With the Met Office predicting more bad weather, it sure looks like residents here are in for a tough time. Your report, we on.